One of the keys to proper incident management is the ability to quickly map out existing incident locations to visualize and share their extent and details with all responding organizations in one common operating picture. Oftentimes these locations exist in a variety of different formats such as in Excel spreadsheets or CSV files. In this example, I will map out a CSV file with incident locations that have been reported through various channels using a web map in ArcGIS Online so it can be easily used as an input layer in a GIS-based situational awareness viewer. First I grab that file and simply drop it into my web map. Then I'm presented a number of different options. I can map things out based on coordinates, actual addresses. Here I'll go ahead and select U and get the United States. And then I map my fields across. I've got incident name, contact, and other things I won't use for geocoding. But then I'll map street across, city, zip code. Let's go ahead and map that to the corresponding field in the locator. And then add that location. So now it simply takes those points and drops them onto a map. I have a number of different options to um, re-symbolize these um, features. I'll leave them as is for now and go back on my legend, and now I've got different locations for dam failures, flooded streets, gathering points, and so on. And I have a lot of new capabilities now that I have this information available in GIS-based format. I can quickly go in and maybe change um, my base map, you know, to look at the surrounding imagery in a particular area to see what's going on. I can also go in and share this information out um, with other members of my org, either as um, web apps or as underlying layers.